Hello YouTubies, this is Freddy Hotez and uh, thank you for watching this YouTube video. Now, I was looking on Facebook today and uh, on one of my friend's Facebook pages, somebody wrote a very, uh, well, a attractive comment that I had to look into. And it was about what the Daily Mail had written recently. Now, this is, you know, I'm, I'm a decent guy, you know, sometimes a bit of a prick sometimes. I, I admit I'm not always 100% sensible on YouTube, but, you know, who gives a fuck? I mean, it's only fucking YouTube. Because <laughs> people take this, uh, you know, as a life, uh, you know, as if it's life and death situation. This is just fucking YouTube, right? But, you know, on the Daily Mail was written something really, 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 really bizarre. Now... I, I'm not usually one to criticise newspapers because we all know they're full of shit. We know that uh, some, most of the time they hype things up, they exaggerate it to make the papers sell. Uh, but, you know, the, the Daily Mail would never advertise radical feminism, now would it? Well, would it? You see, because I've come across this story recently that said that men who hold doors open and smile may actually be sexist. Study claims. Um, may is an interesting word because it's not actual meaning it is, or it's just suggesting that uh, that is the case, which means they can always back up the argument no matter which way it goes, even if it just ends up being totally bullshit. Uh, they get away with it because they put may in, and their study just means nothing basically because there's many studies out there that prove the opposite. Now, not only do they say men who smile may be benevolent sexist, but they go on to all sorts of bizarre ideologies about men, stating that, you know, they're smiling at you, they must be a sexist fucking pig if you're a woman. Never, never trust a man who smiles. Never trust a man who holds the door open for you. What you want, what you want 100%, is a man slamming it in your fucking face. Alright? Because, you know, you, you women, not, actually, no, no, I take that back. It's not women. You newspapers who write this bollocks, right? I've, you know, you are responsible for radical uh, feminism, without a doubt. You're breeding it. You're making women think that they are perpetual victims uh, when they're not. You know, we're, I'm, I'm living in a world right now. Right, where there's kids being blown up in foreign countries, kids actually dying, being, uh, you know, they're being blown up and they end up under rubble, etc., being buried and people trying to bring them out, men, etc., and women. And, uh, you know, they can hold hands quite nicely and be nice to each other in, uh, in their own way. I mean, they don't like people invading their property, but uh, they, 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 they have trouble, right? But then you, you people, write a story like this where you know a man smiling at you or holding a door open for you such a big fucking deal i mean boo fucking who you must have had a fucking easy life i mean get real how how easy of a life can you have where you actually believe that you are a victim because somebody has smiled at you you can can you see just how fucking ridiculous that is can, can, can you actually get from my point of view just how fucking stupid the uh, feminist cult actually is now. And this is what is being written by these newspapers. They're the one we're promoting feminism. Right? So why are you actually saying that men are sexist if they are smiling at you or open the door? It's so fucking trivial that it's beyond fucking comprehension now. That, that's, a, that's a trap to make you guys and girls out there who support feminism look stupid. Because it's no way it's true. You think that's so bad. You, you, you feel fucking victimised just because somebody's holding the fucking door open for you or smiling at you. When there's kids going around having their fucking legs blown off in foreign countries. You, you fuckers have had it fucking too easy. All right? That's your problem. You've had it fucking too easy in your life that you get offended by these sort of trivial matters that don't mean anything. In fact, you're psychotic. All right? I'll go down that route. The feminist cult right now is psychotic because of stuff like this. This is written by your national newspaper. Right? A national newspaper. You know, that thing that you actually get all your education from, that's what's written by it. That is how legitimate 
and how cool your national newspaper is. It's making you all look fucking stupid. Now, I don't disagree with what some of the feminist um, ideologies are. I mean, some of them are pretty good, uh, but most of it isn't. Right? I believe that women should be treated with courtesy. Uh, they don't have to be forced to be married in foreign countries, but I can't do anything about those countries where they are married like that because I don't live there. Right? I can only look around what's happening in my own area and say, yeah, 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 this, this, blah, 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 blah. But I'm not actually seeing anything too bad done to women. In fact, I see more men uh, victims of, of their sexuality or their sex than women are. So if a man happens to be gay, he's likely to be murdered yeah, in certain situations or bullied, etc. That men are more victims of sexism than women are. But uh, you know, it's it, it's gone it's gone out of the uh, control right now. It, something has to be done about this because it's so bloody fucking ridiculous. This this idea that men smiling can open a door for you is sexist was originally a fucking joke. Do you get that? It was originally an insult. It was sarcasm by certain people on the internet. They're saying one day they go complain about people smiling at them and opening the door and bowing down to them as being as sexist. And of course, the, the, the feminist cult will actually find uh, ideologies around that that they might think, oh, actually sexist. Oh, yeah, oh, because yeah, they're trying to impress us or something or trying to get into us. Um, but you, you've got to be careful of these cults because they will damage you. They will, they will perpetuate a victim complex, which, which is exactly what's happening right now. Don't believe a single word they say, uh, don't follow them, and get away from this feminist cult as soon as you can, because all feminists at the moment are in a cult. You're all being brainwashed, you're all being classed as uh, victims. You're not victims, you, get, you have a chance in this life. You can become doctors, nurses, you can become the Prime Minister, you can become the Queen. You've got so many options open for you, it's unbelievable. Uh, yes, women can be the victims of crime, uh, but you know when men are dying in the streets after being shot and knived, etc., uh, and it, not so much with the women. Uh, we're, we're all victims in a certain way. It doesn't necessarily mean that a cult has to be built up out around it, stating that uh, it's because of men are all sexist. I mean, what we really need right now is um, a rethink of what's going on here, because anything that's led by these, these psychotics, lunatics, who write these newspaper articles, um, is, not, is not going well. It actually puts all the women in the, in a bad light. And most of the women I know are actually good people. In fact, I don't believe the women believe in this bullshit. Right? This is how, this is how fucking insane it is. I don't think women actually look at this and go, oh yeah, that makes fucking sense. I think they're thinking, yeah, yeah, whatever. Uh, but they don't realize what they're actually buying is a lot of bullshit. Anyway, every, if they, if they can write bullshit like that, they can write bullshit about anything. The, even the Daily Mail has actually embarrassed themselves by writing this article. And that was written today. Now, I'll leave the article down below so you people can actually see it. But, uh, you know, this, 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 this cult has to stop one way or the other. Because it's embarrassing for women, it's embarrassing for men, and it's embarrassing for humanity. End of. Anyway, thank you for watching and uh, goodbye for now. Uh, see you later.